Okay, time for a new video. Welcome back to my channel, or hello if you're new. As always, I'm filming this video in one go, so it's possible I'll stumble over my words moving forwards and maybe get a few things inaccurate. And hopefully the quality of this video is not too bad either. There may be a little bit of lag. If so, apologies for that. It is the best I can do. We are moments away from finding out the results of this year's Junior Eurovision Song Contest, which has taken place today in Nice in France. 16 acts took to the stage, but there can only be one winner, determined by the public vote, which is online. I've done my bit today, and indeed the other day, when the first voting window opened. And of course, the national juries who voted last night. I've made two pages of notes notes for my long rambling review which should be up on my channel within the next 24 hours or so so stick around if you're at all interested for that and if you didn't see one of my most recent videos I predicted that Spain would win this was made before the full running order was announced followed by France Armenia the UK the Netherlands North Macedonia Germany Georgia Poland Malta Ukraine Ireland Estonia Italy Portugal and Albania the jury votes are going to be announced first. I am expecting France to do the double. Martin Oesterdal is just talking. One hundred and seventy-five countries, people in those nations have voted. Um, I'm going to keep my thoughts very brief in this video because I am saving myself for that rambling review. Um, Spain was excellent, the UK was great, Armenia was fairly strong, France was good, uh, Netherlands was good, um, so many of the performances were very, very impressive. You know, nobody disappointed, which is usually the case. Um, everybody did the best job they could, and full credit to these young artists, because being on that stage, it's not easy. I'm quite calm, because it's very likely one of my favourites is going to win. Um, if Spain don't win, I'm sure there'll be a lot of upset people, but it certainly should be right up there challenging for victory, as should the Netherlands, as should Armenia, as should the UK, as should be France. Here we go. Ten points to the UK from Spain. We'll have that. Yes, 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 yes. Hmm, yes, yes. France. Spain to France. Well, it begins. Spain give 12 to France. I mean, France... I mean, the juries are so far up. France is derriere. It's unbelievable. Malta are voting now. 10 to the UK. Come on. Who are Malta going to give 12 to? Possibly Armenia. Quite like the green outfit. Do feel free to let me know your thoughts, of course. Armenia get the 12 from Malta, moves them into third place. But France, joint top with the UK early on. I don't know why I've got my book here now. Ukraine, loving the hat. Oh, there's a chance here for Stand Unique. There's a chance here. Estonia have their first point. Yes. UK, not Georgia. Come on! Yes, Ukraine! Have it! It's starting well. It's starting well. The juries are liking the UK. Ireland, give the UK four. So, um, that's the end of them. Katur and I, we're going to give the 12 points to France. I think. Spain are struggling here. Yeah, yeah. They move into first place again. It's very close. Poland are doing very well. Very well indeed. Ah, the UK are voting next. I have a feeling the UK jury will like Armenia. The little boy from that little film in Liverpool earlier in the year, you might remember it. He's on the British jury. The UK gave Spain eight. Well done. Albania doing well. Vocal powerhouse. Armenia get 12. It's close at the top. Ireland have diddly squat so far, which is disgraceful. Disgraceful. North Macedonia, come on, give us big points. 
Seven. Seven for the UK. Netherlands are doing alright. This is going to be 12 for Armenia again, I think. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Yes, Armenia could go back to back here. I do wonder about that public mark, though. I really do, because I'm not sure it will be as high as some other countries. Estonia next. Six for the UK. A few points in the lead now, France. Estonia? Spain? Yes, well done, Estonia. Yes, they know what they're doing, Estonia. Lovely, lovely. They're rattling through this. Oh, maybe Ukraine getting the 12 here. Eight for the UK. France starting to pull ahead a little bit. Ireland, nothing. Oh, Malta get the 12. Oh, Georgia aren't doing very well here. But then again, the song, with all due respect, not one of their finest. Look at that guy's moustache. Poland, come on. Eight. Oh, this is another 12 for France. It's another 12 for France. France. Yeah, they're starting now to motor ahead. What I will say about that performance, it was very dark until the very end. Georgia. Oh, there's a chance here. Come on, Georgia. Put us back in contention. Or else... Ireland have points. That's nice. Let's not waste time. North Macedonia, out of it. Absolutely out of it. United Kingdom, come on. Oh! It goes to Spain. Georgia didn't like Stan Unique. Uh, we'll never mention them again. But there we go. The UK still in third place. But France now with a nice lead. Portugal. Ah. Only one. Oh, this will be 12 to Spain again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stick together. Spain, Spain. Ah, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry, Portugal just blanked Spain. War tomorrow. You heard it here first. Albania were doing very well. France next. Four to the UK. Oh, Spain. Oh, Christ. Albania are having an absolute marvellous year. Absolutely marvellous year. Spain are on the rise. They move into third place. The UK are fourth. As long as it stays close, we could be on for a very, very tight finish. Chance for the UK here. Albania, 7 for France, 6 to Armenia, 10 to Spain. We need the 12. We need the 12. Oh, but Albania love Italy, don't they? Oh, heavens. The UK... Come on! Whoops. <laughs> yes. Yes. Italy, come on. Uh, it'll, it'll be Spain here. The UK are on 90. Armenia, 96. France, 116. Netherlands might be out of it, even with a big public mark. Albania, the success of the jury vote. How can you give Albania 69 and Estonia 6? Spain. Spain, Spain, move into third place. It's very, very tight at the top, which is what we should be getting. Absolutely. Germany now. Oh, this will be Armenia getting the 12. Spain move into second. Oh. You sound a bit Australian. <laughs> Armenia! 
Armenia get the 12. Look how close this is. But France do have a nice, maybe just big enough lead going into the public votes. But we have the Netherlands now. Oh, it's 12 for France. It's going to be 12 for France again. The UK finish on 102 in the jury vote. Could be a similar situation to last year, our result then. Yes, you can. Estonia were last. I'm fuming. I'm fuming. France. It's going to go to France. That's a 20-point lead. And France will do well in the public vote. So, oh, I feel really deflated because I think we know what's coming here. But, you never know. You never know. I mean, if France win again, so be it. But, there's the top three. No surprises, really. Spain started slowly. 115. Armenia, 116. France, 136. That might be a big enough lead already to see France come out on top. Lots of people chanting for Spain. There's a lot of Spanish fans there. Yeah, yeah. I don't think the UK are doing it now unless France and Armenia completely fall to pieces, which isn't going to happen. It's not going to happen. Online votes. Hold on to your drinks if you've got one. Oh boy. Oh boy. I'm alright because a song that I do enjoy is going to win. Estonia. 30. 43 for Estonia. If that finishes last, disgrace. Ireland. 34 for Ireland. Well, yeah. Georgia. 43. Same. Oh, 53. 53 for Georgia. Portugal. They've done well in the online vote previously. 45 for Portugal. Above Georgia. Well, who saw that coming? Germany. This could be big. That's good. 74 points. Germany's best result to date. But they're still going to finish on the right-hand side, I think. Italy. No more than 40. 44. Wow. Not bad for Italy, actually. Ireland will be last. Disgrace. North Macedonia. Oh, 39. There you go. Same old story with North Macedonia in the online vote. Oh, France have got this in the bag. Ukraine, 50 plus. It, it, was, it was good. Oh, that's big. That's big. 83 for Ukraine. And I think, that's, I think that's justified. I thought that was really smashing. The confidence of that young girl. Sublime. Malta next. Five points. Oh, that's not bad. 43 for Malta. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Above North Macedonia. Well, well, well. Georgia are going to finish right near the bottom here. Netherlands. <gasps> oh, that's low for the Dutch. That's low for the Dutch. Below Ukraine. Poland next. 55 for Poland. Above the Dutch. The Netherlands underperforming again. What's th what is this? What is this? Albania. I can't imagine this will be too high. But it's a success story nevertheless. She's very calm. 45 big ones for Albania. Not bad. It's the UK now. This has to be over 100. No doubt about it. It's got to be massive. 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 Well, come on. 900 bajillion. Oh. oh yeah. That's well off the pace. That's well off the pace. 
Ukraine might have won the public vote here. You never know. We're in first place. We're not staying there. There's no way we're staying there. Um, oh, man. Oh, man. It's Francis to lose. Mon Dieu. Who's next? I haven't got a clue. Put the scoreboard up. Spain, 86 whoppers. They move into first place. Is that enough to do it? Is that enough to do it? I don't think so. I don't think so. I don't think so. The UK are not winning. Oh, no, it's fine. It's fine. Didn't predict it. Armenia. Spain are on 201. Yep. Yeah. Armenia are out. Out, out. So it's France or Spain. France needs... Oh, 80 plus. They're going to get this. They're going to get this. Armenia look very upset about that, to be honest. It's okay. It's okay. They only need about 70 points. Oh, Spain. Oh, it's all over for you, darlings. There's no way. I mean, Ukraine, 83 points. My God. France have won this. France have won this. Oh, 66. Oh, pile of P. Easy. 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 Oh, Spain, man. Spain. The curse of being on first, you could argue. 66 points. Come on. They're going to get that. There's no way they're not going to get it. No way they're not going to get it. Oh, why are you dragging this out, you fools? I want Spain, but it's going to be France. Oh, heavens above. Spain thought they'd won it then. Oh, France are going to get that 60-plus mark. Sixty-six points. They're going to get at least seventy-five here. I mean, talk about dragging it out. I mean, I'm aging here. Hold on to your capes. God Almighty, fire this man! They've won it. That's the online vote winner. France, do it again. I mean, I dread to think what the social media comments are going to be like. No surprises then. No real shocks at all. Albania doing well with the juries, maybe. Ireland last. And France have won again. Next year we need somebody different. We need somebody different. Um, well, credit where credit's due. Zoe Klaus you with Kerr. <laughs> nobody clapping at the back here. Absolutely nobody. <laughs> oh man. Netherlands underperformed in the online vote. I'd like to know what that was about. Um, and the UK didn't get as nearly a bigger score as I thought either, but France absolutely walked it in the end. It wasn't a massive victory, but it was a huge online mark. So, uh, there we go. Let me know your thoughts on this. It's France again next year, uh, unless they decline, in which case Spain might take the reins. Well, well, I liked the performance. I just thought it was quite dark. And, uh, well, there you go. 
I don't really have anything else to add. My long rambling review will be up tomorrow as we near 20 minutes for this video. It's a good time for me to shut up. Let me know what you think. Until next time, congratulations to France again. See you again soon. Au revoir for now.